Hey everybody, thank you so much for choosing to watch Life's Magical Journey. I'm Life, and this is the safest space for us to learn, grow, and share our experiences when it comes to our spiritual journey. So as you're watching the video, go ahead and consider subscribing to the channel. Now this Friday, guys, we are doing a live. I want you guys to join me on Friday, February 26th, and I want to talk about unique ways to meditate. Once you hear the super unique ways I have listed for you guys, I want you guys to come back and meet me here on Friday so we can talk it through and you can share your unique ways to meditate. So that's Friday, February 26, 2021, 11 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Set an alarm, do what you got to do, but meet me back here for that. We've been talking a lot about letting go of limiting beliefs. We've talked about that for a couple of weeks and we have a whole playlist that you can watch and figure out what limiting beliefs are, how to recognize that you are feeling those limitations, maybe from childhood, but we talk in depth about how to begin letting them go. All right, then we started to talk about meditation. So we do have a couple videos already on the channel about meditation and how powerful it is, what it is. So to remind you meditation is just you bringing yourself to that present moment you're not thinking about the past you're not thinking about the future you're just living in the now so in today's video we're talking about five powerful ways that you can meditate and five very unique ways these are not the regular sitting home type of meditation so if you are ready to get into it i am ready to share with you the ways that i meditate very unique and powerful so let's go ahead and get started so my first very unique and powerful way to meditate is going to be burning bay leaves you guys know i'm not a doctor i am doing my own research and i'm sharing with you the things that i do and so this is a very powerful way that I use to meditate. I burn bay leaves. That chemical that's in there called linalool, it is excellent with helping to relieve anxiety, which means of course that it's very calming. It's something that is going to relax your mind and your body and allow you to use your sense of smell and just meditate on that smell. It's very powerful. It's a very unique way to meditate. You guys need to look into it and you need to give that a try if that resonates with you. I recommend this when you're listening to me or any other spiritual youtuber I want you guys to take what resonates and leave the rest it's okay that not everything resonates with you okay so let's move on to number two number two is gonna be yoga yoga is a very very powerful way to meditate it actually brings you it brings you into that connected state where you are focused on those poses you are focused on the mantras that you're doing you're Focus on the stretches that you're doing. And so it is very meditative. And I suggest that especially if you're the type of person that feels like you can't meditate or you feel like your mind is just going 100 miles a minute, like we have 70,000 thoughts in a day, right? So if you are one of those people that are maybe just starting now, yoga might be the best meditation for you. So I definitely recommend to try that unique way to meditate because yoga is powerful. Number three, number three is one of my favorites. Number three is bathing. You guys have probably heard me mention bathing here on the channel several times. I love to take a bath. I love the hot water, just relaxing in it. You might want to put some oils, some salts, and some rose petals in there and just relax and just enjoy that bath. That is definitely a very powerful way to meditate. It is amazing. And I just got out of the bathtub, so <laughs> I'm, I'm in my head, I'm still in there, okay? I love of it. I, I imagine that hot water just relieving me of any stress. It's cleansing me of any negativity or any tightness in my muscles. It's just going to wash away with that bath water. Absolutely a very powerful way to meditate. You have to give it a try, male or female. I know most of my audience is female, but male or female, you absolutely need to take a bath and let that be your meditation. Number four. Number four is going to be what I like to call water drips I just started doing this pretty recently is when I get out of the bath or when I get out of the shower I sit on the edge of the tub and I just focus for a few minutes just on the drips that are dripping down my body I love this meditation so much it is it brings so much connectedness to your senses you are engaging your senses and you feel that water just 
dripping down from every piece of your body. You can feel it on your feet, your legs, your arms, your hips. I mean, you just feel the water everywhere. Little tiny drips just tickling you. And just it just it feels amazing. If you guys have not stopped and enjoyed that moment when you're getting out of the shower or getting out of the bathtub, you absolutely have to take time to just stop in that moment and enjoy a quick, very quick meditation as you're getting out of the shower. Last one, guys, number five is going to be eating. You know that there are monks that will separate themselves from their friends or family just to eat. Eating is very powerful in and of itself, right? I mean, hopefully you are eating foods that are more alive than dead, right? But um, when you take that time alone and just eat and enjoy your food, you're thanking your food for nourishing your body, you're, you're bridging that connection with your food and you're making that moment special. You might even, sometimes if you hear yourself chewing, you might be eating some almonds or some walnuts or something that you can really hear yourself chewing the food. And that's another way that you can definitely meditate. It is so powerful, guys. You've got to try these super unique ways to meditate and to bring yourself into that present moment. I promise you it will change your life for the better if you let it, okay? So remember, these are conscious decisions that we're making. So join me here this Friday because I definitely want to engage with you guys. I want you guys to share with me some meditations that you come up with, even if they're brand new, you know, come up with some unique ways. Now that you see how creative you can get with it, I want you to come up with some very unique ways. Meet me here on Friday at 11 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. If you enjoyed this video, I want you just to simply hit the like button. Go ahead and comment, hang out, and engage with the channel a little bit. And definitely go back and watch those other videos that I talked about. All right, I'm going to put them up on the screen. I'm going to put the playlist here, and I'll put just a single video right here for you. All right, so thank you guys so much once again for joining me today, and I'll see you soon.